right now on the approval matrix. Coolness, what the heck happened to it? We'll use the power of the matrix and our panel of experts to find out. Plus, special guests, Chris Rock and Amy Poehler. And now your host, Neil Brennan. Hey. Remember on Happy Days when the jukebox would break and the Fonz would fix it just by punching it? That's how cool people solved problems back then, with violence. <laughs> it, was, it was awesome. Nowadays, if the jukebox broke, the Fonz would probably use tools and know-how. You know, nerd stuff. <laughs> back then, he was the Fonz. He wore a leather jacket and rode a motorcycle. He was promiscuous. Today, he'd probably go by his real name, Henry Winkler, and ride a Segway and have a long-term girlfriend. <laughs> Yuck. What we consider cool has done a complete 180. I personally have always defined cool based on what black people were doing, and now I don't know what to think. <laughs> because they seem to think that being a nerd is cool. Let's take Pharrell, for example. This man was born good-looking, talented, and black. That's everything I've ever dreamed of. <laughs> He used to make songs about selling crack and shooting people. It was glorious. <laughs> now he's traded all that in for this Arby's hat and songs about being happy. He's voluntarily become Bobby McFerrin. <laughs> and how about this dumpy four eyes? Actually, this nerd is a millionaire and one of the biggest movie stars on Earth. Meanwhile, Tom Cruise is a loser, <laughs> to say nothing of poor Iceman. <laughs> Hey, Iceman, when Maverick said you could be his wingman, I don't think he meant buffalo wings. <laughs> but what makes this even more aggravating is that most of these cool nerds aren't even actually nerds. They just have the props, especially models. Models love claiming to be nerds, and by nerds, they mean their assistants use an iPhone to order cocaine for them. <laughs> but maybe nerds on top is a good thing, right? The oppressed have risen up, justice has prevailed, or has it? Aggression may be out, but in nerd town, passive aggression is in. Instead of lording their physique over their lessers, nerds now lord their taste over them. You like Pitbull unironically? Yuck. <laughs> as far as the new cools are concerned, if you don't like what they like, you might as well have a kick me sign on your back. That's right, taste shaming is the new purple nurple, and quite frankly, my nurples are purples. <laughs> Let's try to figure it all out together as we ask, who died and made you cool right now on The Approval Matrix? The Approval Matrix, all new Mondays at 11.